Rosa Parks. Once upon a time, Montgomery, Alabama was a segregated city. Black people and white people went to different schools, prayed in different churches, shopped in different stores, rode different elevators, and drank from different drinking fountains. Everyone rode the same buses, but they had to sit in different areas. White people up front, black people at the back. Rosa Parks grew up in this black and white world. It was hard for black people, and many were angry and sad because of segregation. But if they protested, they were thrown in jail. One day, 42-year-old Rosa was sitting in the back of the bus on her way home from work. It was crowded, and there were not enough seats in the front section. The wine reserved for whites. So the driver told Rosa to give up her seat so the white person could sit down. Rosa said, "No." She spent the night in jail, but this one brave act showed people that it was possible to say no to injustice. Rosa's friends declared a boycott. They asked every single black person not to use any of the buses in the city until the law was changed. The word spread fast and wide. The boycott lasted for three hundred and eighty-one days. It ended when bus segregation was declared unconstitutional by the U.S. Supreme Court. It took ten years for segregation to be banned in any other state, but it happened finally, thanks to Rosa's first brave no.